Okay, that doesn't sound good. That was rattling chains. That was some rattling chains and shit. What the fuck is this? Um, come on, examine it. A large statue stands silently in the darkness. I don't remember what this is for. I don't think that's for a puzzle, I'm, I'm pretty sure. Because once you come out of here, you never really need to come out again. Uh... And this place is pretty much one big fucking straight line. You really don't have to worry about getting lost. I mean, it's not hard. This place isn't difficult. Over here, my friends. And I probably should have taken that F8 spray, but I'll take it later. Uh, there's an item box, so I can drop the ink ribbons. and I might as well mix these green herbs. Uh... Since I'm not gonna have enough time, since I really don't want to waste time like picking them up when I when I'm getting out of this place. Um, as I was saying, if we go through the gate, there would be a thing called a crank. There would there would be something like a there'd be something like a there'd be a f a moat or a pool. I'm pretty sure it's a pool because it has two ladders. Um, man. Jesus Christ, dude. what the fuck? Pumpkins? What the fucking shit? I can't even examine those damn things. Fireplace. There's a fire that looks fresh. So, apparently someone has recently lit in a fire, eh? There's a map of the courtyard. Take it. Oh, I'm, I missed this in uh, Chris's story. Way to go. I missed that in my test playthrough. Dumbass me. Uh, save point there. I'm not going to be using it. Crude bed. It looks like... No one's used it in a long time. Yeah, I wouldn't want to sleep in that thing. That thing looks fucking ridiculous. Okay, go over here. There's a note. A family picture. There's a journal left by someone. Daddy attacked first. Mom attacked second. Inside red and slimy. White and red. And not, not true. Mom where? Don't know. Don't know. Dad found mom again. When attacked mommy, she moved no more. She's screaming, why? I just want to be with her. For mom, where? I miss you. I, I don't know why the fuck I did that. Just, it, it's, an, it's an unimportant... It's an unimportant fucking thing. Don't fucking take it too fucking deep. Okay. Um, do I really fucking need the shotgun? Perfectly honestly, do I need the goddamn shotgun? Okay, first let's just fucking line up that ammo. Oh, 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 uh, drop the fucking ink ribbons. No, keep the fucking ink ribbons on me, just in case. Um, oh, finally, uh, oh, by the way, I figured out what the first aid boxes are. It, like, took me a while to fucking remember. Um, I'll, I'll show you guys later. Uh, let's get the fuel canteen and the lighter, you know, just in case. Take the wind crest as, what, what? Take the wind crest, asshole, thank you. Took the wind crest. Go down here. Don't worry, th nothing's gonna pop out. Here's a crank. Oh, for a minute I was cutscene. I thought, I don't know. Well, um, chances are if you ever see a shot, chances are if you ever see a a cr what the fuck was that? Someone came in here. There's no point in like putting your gun on. Let me just say, chances are if you ever see a crank. A crank, a green herb, or an, or something else. It's always a Resident Evil. You know it's a Resident Evil game. Holy shit, someone just knocked us out. But it makes no sense why they didn't just kill us while we're unconscious. Welcome to the mind fuck, As I like to call it. Because this bitch is fucking creepy. Holy shit. What the fuck is this? Who the fucking balls is this? Oh, uh, this is good old Lisa Trevor, and she's fucking fucked up. Yes, the fucking George Trevor and Jessica Trevor's daughter. That's Lisa Trevor. And, uh, she's been experimented on. She's been injected with multiple things, mutating her beyond fucking belief. That explains why she's so fucked up. She's wearing her mother's face because she ripped off her mother's face when she 
when she believed that her mother was an imposter. And then she's delirious that her father killed her mother when her father has been in like a in, been in that coffin since he since they fucking came there. So, and the reason I brought the wind crest along is uh, because puzzle and shit. But yeah, Lisa Trevor. If anyone's wondering why I didn't shoot her, is because she is impervious to ammo. She's impervious to any gun you throw at her. That's not even a joke. She's, like, immortal. There's something written in this in adhesion. When the wind, wind sweeps across the earth, the stars will shine in the heavens. Use the goddamn wind crest. Ah, you fucking crows. Leave me alone, you pieces of shit. Okay, now, as you can see, there's a star. There's a moon crest. A star crest and a sun crest. I think this is, if memory serves me correctly, this is like a throwback to the original Resident Evil. Because instead of collecting death masks in the original Resident Evil, you had to collect. There's a button when you press it. Uh, you have to, you have to collect like the. There are two projecting lines. You have to collect stuff like these crests. I remember the moon and the sun crest. There's a button when you press it. I'm not sure about the... I'm not... The base is protruding in the shape of a cross. I'm not sure about the star... I'm pretty sure the star was one, too. There's a button. Will you press it? Three projecting... There are three projecting lines. Okay. Nothing unusual, yeah. Okay, go over this. There's something carved in the indentations. Two vertical lines across and three horizontal lines. It's gonna be some kind of symbol. Use the moon crest. Use the sun crest, I mean the star crest, and then use the sun sun crest. And oh, look at that! My favorite gun in the whole goddamn world. A gun has been placed neatly inside. Ah, oh, will you take the mag revolver? Why would I not? Oh, I love this baby. Uh, fuck yeah. It's loaded with magnum rounds. Fuck yes, I love this gun. But, too bad I'm not going to be using it unless on a boss fight. So, haha. <laughs> yeah, you're not going to be seeing the awesomeness that is the magnum anytime soon. Like, I might use one shot to take out a, a dog. But that's pretty much it, my friends. Nothing else. Nothing else doing. Okay, we can now leave. This, uh, this area is pretty much useless to us now that we got the Magnum and shit. Um, all... Now, you encounter Lisa Trevor, like, three times in the game. Only at the final encounter can you allegedly kill her. But she doesn't actually die. You know, in Resident Evil Umbrella Chronicles, it's revealed that when people are escaping... I'm not... When spoiler character is escaping, uh, she's actually alive. Take this, uh, F8 sp What? I was going for the fucking shelf, you asshole. Give me a fucking break. Okay. But, uh, yeah, yeah that zombie I was talking about. Yeah, but Lisa Trevor, like I said before, she she's pretty much like the nemesis and the Mr. X of this game. Mr. X was in, like, pretty much this stalker character that you had to kill way later on uh, in Resident Evil 2. And, and, ne and Nemesis was this, uh, thing... Try not to spoil it for Resident Evil 3. Because I like Resident Evil. You can hear me, just give me a sign. Anything. Jill to Brad, can you hear me? No. I don't fucking care. Uh, shit. <laughs> Broken. I, I never, I don't remember that scene. I don't remember her ever saying shit. There's like fucking several thousand dogs here. Just, there's like three dogs there just to run. Okay, welcome to the jungle. It gets worse here every day. Learn to live like a dynamo. Some shit I don't remember because I don't really like Guns N' Roses. I mean, they have good music, but Axl Rose is a complete douchebag. We all can agree that Axl Rose is a complete douchebag. And use the crank and the water rises. I don't under, I don't know what to call this. I don't think it's a pool. I don't know what the fuck it is. Is it like a... I can't really call this a pool because, you know, there's like a sewage drain. You can hear the sound of a waterfall in the distance. 
that was not really needed. Like, no one gives a fuck about a waterfall. Like, well, this is going a whole lot faster than expected. Jeez. On hard mode, I think there's, like, a zombie on this walkway. Don't worry, the fucking thing is safe as shit. God damn. Okay. Go over here. Yes, over here. Across this little walkway, which I know there's zombies in the hard mode. And now we're going down. Because it's a loving an elevator, bitch.